Say hi from Cherish Math. This is our problem today. Three identical circles, each with the radius of five units, are inscribed in an equilateral triangle. Find the perimeter of this equilateral triangle. Let me label the corners of this triangle with A, B, and C. I begin with joining a line from the corner A to the center of the top circle. And this green triangle that I form up here is in the right angle because line AC is a tangent to the circle on the top and the circle at the bottom right. And the same scenario is going to apply on the left side of the top corner. That would be something like this. I am going to repeat the same process for the corner B and the corner C. And this is how it looks like. And I am here to confirm that for this part is at the right angle and for this part too, which I indicate here and there. Let me focus on the corner B and to work out what is the length of BD. This white line in between of the two triangles up and down serves as the bisector of the corner. So we get here as half of the 60 degrees which is at 30 degrees. Let the center of this circle be O and the radius given is 5 units. So we can find by using BDO as the triangle what is the length of the side BD. In the triangle of BDO, I can use trigonometric tangent tan 30 degrees is equal 5 divided by B D and the value of B D that I am going to get is by using 5 divided by tangent 30 degrees further working on it B D is 5 divided by 1 over square root of 3 so the length of B D is now 5 square root of 3. This is the length of the BD. 5 square root of 3. For the length of BD is applicable for this part as well. And now we need to decide what is the length that connecting from the center of the left circle to the center of the right circle. That is exactly twice of the radius which means this length is at 5 plus 5, 10 units. And it is the same for this part, which is at the 10 units. I can now work out what is the length of BC by simply adding up 5 multiplied square root of 3 plus 10 plus 5 times square root of 3. Now, let me make it simpler. That would be 10 plus 10 times square root of 3. Now, I'm going to work out the entire perimeter of this equilateral triangle simply by multiplying this length of BD by a factor of 3 because we have same sides, three same sides for this equilateral triangle and that turns 30 plus 30 times the square root of 3 and this gives a value approximately 82 units and now we solve the puzzle. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.